is Dr. Donna. Welcome to week 38. Last week, we read an awesome book. It was called Don't Set Goals the Old Way. Now, I thought, here we go again with one of these step one, two, three. This is the new way to set goals. But there were two parts of this book that really resonated with me. The first part is it said, instead of getting to a goal, why don't you be the thing that you're searching for or you're wanting to accomplish? So instead of thinking about and setting goals to be an Olympic champion, why don't you become or be the Olympic champion and every day you wake up being what you're working towards? If you want to be a millionaire, then you need to do the things that millionaires do. You need to be the goal instead of setting the goal. Isn't that cool? I thought that was amazing. The second and most relevant part that resonated with me, instead of being a goal setter, be a goal getter. That means you go and get those goals. You wake up every day focused on getting what you are setting out to do. Doesn't that make sense? Because sometimes when you set goals, you know, it's on the list, it's in your email, you text it to yourself, and that's all you've done is set it and forget it. You can't do that with your goals. You have to take action. And in order to take action, you got to go get it. So from now on, after you finish watching this video and going forward, you are now deputized. Ding! I have made you a goal getter. Now go out there and get it. The TED Talk last week was about becoming mentally strong. This TED Talk had a lot of golden nuggets. I mean, I thought I was just mining for gold because it was so many, 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 many little snippets and tidbits that I could just use and apply. But as you know, I just want to leave you with one. And the one that resonated the most with me was in order to have great mental strength, you got to get rid of those bad habits. You know, it only takes 21 days to form a good habit or a bad habit. You got to get rid of those bad habits, even those micro bad habits. When you know, you see that Facebook friend that seems like they have the perfect life. And that's the example that she used in the TED talk. And you're kind of jealous, even if you just go, I'm so, so sick of her. Her life can't be that perfect. Or if you're at work and someone gets the promotion that you think you should have gotten, even though you know you suck. Yeah those type of bad habits you need to get rid of and you're going to replace them with good habits so instead of being jealous or envious you're going to replace that with gratitude and peace we know i talk about that all the time being grateful and having the mindset to create what you want and she just reaffirmed that with this week's TED talk so in summary you're going to do two things after you stop watching this video Number one, you are a goal getter. You've been deputized. And number two, you're going to get rid of all that garbage and bad habits inside of your mind. You're going to replace it with the things that you actually want. Okay? Got it? We're good? Okay? Thumbs up? Yes? Cool. This week's book is Business the Jack Welch Way. He was a great CEO, and we know all the things that he did for GE, and so we're going to find out what those are and be able to apply them to our business, our professional life, and our personal life, because leadership transcends all platforms. This week, TED Talk is some more secrets, and it's the secret of self-control. Now, some of you know you need it because you lose control at the drop of a hat. Let somebody cut you off in traffic, it ain't nothing nice of you who are just now joining us, I'd like to say welcome. You are at the right place at the right time. Now, that link below, that one that says Answers Are Us slash 5050 Challenge, that's the one that you're going to click on. And then you're going to register, and then you're going to receive an email to tell you what the next steps are. For you, you have three things to do. Goal getter, get rid of all that mental bad habits, and you need to sign up. For the rest of us, we're just going to read our book and we're going to look at our TED Talks and we're going to see each other next week. Because as I always say, when you can see it and you can read it, then you can believe it. And of course you can achieve it. From here to the Galaxy Fear. I'll see you guys next week. Au revoir.